Hello, so yes, you read that intro right. I'm gonna be showing y'all my life routine to living a stress-free or at least low stress life. So pretty much my whole life, I've really struggled with high stress levels to the point where sometimes I am physically sick and stress in general is just tied to so many health problems. It's been a long journey of healing and finding ways to manage my stress. So today I'm gonna be diving into all the things that have cured my stress like actual good tips that you can do every day in a routine as a habit and the benefits of each of those things. Today's video is sponsored by Phyla, which I'll tell you guys about later when I do my skincare routine. Now, every good habit starts with a good morning routine. And I'm gonna sprinkle in stuff other than those six factors that have really helped me as well. First, I love to get in the sun within the first hour of being awake. It wakes you up, it gives you this like hit of dopamine, and it's just such a great way to start the day. Now, I can't eat vitamins on an empty stomach. It makes me feel sick. So before I go to the gym, after I take my vitamins, I'm just gonna have a little cereal bar. This is like a protein cereal bar from like an awesome brand. This brand is called Magic Spoon. And it is high protein, keto friendly, gluten free, grain free, soy free, wheat free, nothing artificial. And it's cookies and cream flavor. Now I'm gonna give you a tour of my vitamins. I just wanna preface by saying like, I'm no professional at this. This is just based on my own research. I would definitely recommend doing some research. And I also don't know about these specific brands that my vitamins vitamins are, so do your own research. <laughs> My first two things I started taking is vitamin D and zinc. These help a lot with like staying healthy, like literally not getting colds or any sort of sickness. And then especially in the winter when we're not really out in the sun as much, vitamin D is so important. So this is kind of what kicked off my journey. I started doing more research about just like stress relief and mood and found some awesome products. First is magnesium. Fish oil, especially for women. These are called Mood Guard. I have a friend at church who works at like a whole health place and so they use a lot of supplements and vitamins and this one's called Mood Guard and it is so helpful for just mood, stress relief, all that kind of stuff. This is what the packaging looks like for that one. Then I have these that came in little packages and this includes, I don't know how to pronounce it, I'm gonna show you this thing. <laughs> and then I have two multivitamin pills in here as well that literally includes vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin E, vitamin B6, vitamin B12, choline, calcium, iron, magnesium, and potassium. And then this one is literally like the queen of like mood stabilization, lithium orotate five. This stuff is just amazing. I just want to explain that lithium orotate, the supplement, is not the same thing as the type of lithium that gets prescribed from a psychiatrist. This is not a prescription drug, although the name lithium is the same. It's lithium orotate, not the like pharmaceutical drug lithium. Look it up if you don't know what I'm talking about. Now you guys can just literally watch me struggle. I've gotten better, but I'm still not a pro at taking pills. And it tastes so bad. <laughs> I hate it every time. Now food. Now for another huge factor in my life routine, going to the gym. Let's talk about the benefits of going to the gym for stress relief, which I think is pretty self-explanatory, but oh my gosh, does it actually make a big difference? I can get all my stress, anger, and anxiety out. Lifting makes me feel so much more confident and I feel accomplished. I release endorphins and the benefits are insane. Even if you're not working out to look a certain way, working out makes you feel top notch. I recently have changed my mindset to, I need to go to the gym to look a certain way and I want to lose weight to, I need to go to the gym so I feel good about my Myself, and not just physically but mentally as well. My goal right now is to go three times a week but I have been going more like four to six days a week since the new year and I'm working on a progressive overload plan with a three-day split and then doing some cardio on any of the other days. Now, also something that has amazing benefits that I kind of tied in with going to the gym is getting in the sauna. My gym has a sauna, so I'll usually go sit in for about 10 minutes or more. Now, once again, the benefits of a sauna are absolutely insane. I feel less stressed literally the second I walk in. So apparently it helps improve heart health, helps with pain, improves mental health symptoms, helps with your skin, reduces inflammation, and decreases your stress hormone levels. It gets out toxins, helps with headaches, and apparently decreases your risk of colds and viral illnesses. So if that doesn't convince you that you should go try to find a sauna. I don't know what will, but I have been loving it. 
solid workout and sauna sesh. I think it's really cool because I'm not really focused as much on how I look, more so how I feel and pushing myself. So with my progressive overload program, I am lifting so much heavier than I ever have before and I think that's really cool. What you eat matters so much for your physical and your mental health. Food is tied to like everything in your body. For me, right now I'm on the carnivore diet. Sometimes it's a little more keto and it works really well for me for energy levels, stress levels, all of that. I'm still trying to figure out what foods I want to reincorporate or not. I highly recommend that everyone goes down their own little food journey and work on cutting out sugar and processed foods. I'm back from the gym and I'm gonna hop in the shower and then do my skincare routine, which takes us to the sponsor of today's video, Phyla. Now washing my hair today, so I'm gonna put it up. So Phyla is three steps. They have their cleanser, their serum, and their moisturizer. So first I'm gonna shower and use the Phyla gel cleanser. Dump your other acne products. You just need Phyla's three-step system. It clears acne in 60 days. It's non-drying and non-irritating, unlike other traditional acne treatments. There are no acne relapses. It increases the skin microbiome diversity. Now I'm all showered and clean, so I'm gonna move on to step two of the Phyla products. This is a probiotic serum. So my face has been I'm cleansed with the cleanser, pat dry, and now I'm going to add the serum. This is the biggest acne breakthrough in 40 years. So a little bit more about the serum. The live probiotic in the serum goes to work in killing only the acne causing bacteria, allowing the good bacteria to flourish and build a resilient microbiome. Now I use this serum every day and every night. And now that it is fully absorbed, I'm going to add the moisturizer. I really love how this moisturizer feels on my skin. It's such a simple and perfect skincare routine. Only three steps for clear skin. Phyla's three-step system consists of a cleanser, a serum, and a moisturizer, as I just showed you. The gel cleanser is a non-foaming cleanser that gently exfoliates your skin and opens up the pores to get them ready to receive the serum. After the cleanser, you'll apply the serum, which contains live phagins. These go into your pores and start controlling the overgrowth of acne bacteria. Then finally, you'll follow up with the fluff moisturizer. It's designed to keep the live phages active and it is incredibly light yet hydrating moisturizer. This system helps with dry skin and keeps your skin nourished, smooth, and supple. Consistent and continued use prevents against relapses and you should use it twice a day, morning and night for the best results. Now, most of Phyla's customers are people who have struggled with acne their entire life, and Phyla has finally given them some relief. I've only been using it for a little bit, and my skin already feels amazing. So y'all don't want to miss out on this. I can even get you a 25% discount code using my code SydneyFrancis25. So make sure to click the link in the description for the softest, smoothest, clear skin ever. Hopping in at nighttime to show you guys that I have been doing this morning and night. So let's change into my pajamas. Next step is to wash off my makeup, get my little headband on. Of course, starting by going in with the Phyla Gel Cleanser. It truly really does feel really good on my face. Wash this off, pat dry. Now for the Phyla Serum. Let the skin absorb it. And finish off with the Phyla Fluff Moisturizer. Mm, it feels so good. It's not too thick or heavy. And boom, skincare done, only three steps before bed, which is amazing. And this is how my skin is looking after using it for a little bit. It's starting to get so soft and clear and I can't wait to see what it looks like after using it for a long time. Most of you guys know that I am a Christian and it has been quite the journey finding Jesus, giving my life to Jesus, and my daily surrender to Jesus. Spending time with God in the mornings is one of the most important parts of my day. When I don't, my whole day is literally a mess. Being able to go to him with my problems, spend time not thinking about myself and just worshiping God, getting to know him through his written word, and even outside of reading the Bible, just some time in prayer and worship, it has helped so much with my emotional health, my spiritual life and just everything in general. So if you don't know Jesus, I would highly recommend starting your relationship with him or reigniting your current relationship. Just to explain in better detail my routine, this is never really in the same order. Sometimes I wake up, first thing I do is spend time with God. Sometimes wake up, go to the gym first thing. Sometimes I go to the gym during my lunch break at work, but I do work a eight to five job. So I just have to find a way to squeeze them in wherever I can. So it has been difficult to find ways to incorporate all this, but it's really important that 
I do. And with that being said, while I'm trying to find the perfect routine to do all these things right now, having a set routine, scheduling out your time, and not just like leaving it open has helped me so much. So either the day before or even in my time with God, I write down everything I need to do in that day, when I can get it done, and just kind of pray over it. I've recently become a reading girly and it has made me so much less stressed being able to just read before bed, relax with a book, dive into a fantasy world. I just finished a really awesome trilogy and just started The Hobbit and I'm going to read The Lord of the Rings. So highly, highly recommend reading and I might be making some reading vlogs soon, so stay tuned. In the same nature as reading, I've been loving podcasts. For my Christian girlies, I recommend Real Talk Christian and Therapy and Theology. And of course, wrapping up this whole video with sleep. I honestly never realized how important sleep was in your life till I started getting good sleep and realizing how much better I felt. So getting a bare minimum of like seven to eight hours a night is top priority for me. And that all starts with a good nighttime routine. So if y'all wanna see my nighttime routine, let me know, I'll do a video on it. Just remember that with all of these, it starts with one, incorporate one new thing in for a while and then slowly build up your habits. I hope this video helped you guys out. Maybe you can start to find ways to be stress-free as well. And comment down below anything else that has helped you. See you guys in the next one. Bye.